Welcome class of 2024 to Rutgers University. We are so excited you're joining us on campus this fall. Hi, I'm Dr. Ann Kar Schmidt. I'm the Director of Undergraduate Advising for Biological Sciences. Biological Sciences is one of the largest and most popular life science majors offered at Rutgers New Brunswick. In fact, we're gonna be graduating over 400 students in 2020. Biological science majors are well prepared to go on to grad school, med school and other health profession programs, careers in education, research and beyond. One of the reasons why the biological science major is so popular is the fact that it's one of the most flexible life science majors. Now all of our students do have to complete a year of general biology with lab and a year of chemistry with lab, a year of organic chemistry with lab and a year of physics with lab. And they also have to complete a year of college math, including Calc 1 and either Calc 2 or a statistics course and a semester of genetics. But after completing that life science core curriculum, students then get to choose from a broad range of life science electives to complete the major. Here at Rutgers, we have over a dozen different life science departments, and our majors have access to electives offered by all of those departments. So whether you're interested in intro to cancer or pathogenic microbio, essentials of cell biology and neuroscience and biochemistry, or perhaps even animal science, um, plant science, uh, entomology courses, you name it, marine science. Um, we've got so many different choices for students to, to select from. Additionally, students are trained uh, in laboratory technique, techniques through our uh, laboratory courses and can also participate in research with faculty members that can, and that credit can count towards their major. Also, for students who are interested in honors biology, students can complete a year-long honors research project senior year, write a thesis, and orally defend. The biological science major is a credit intensive major, and so this means that students are not required to complete a minor, but about 30 to 40% of the students do complete one. Oftentimes it's in the humanities or social sciences, and we encourage our students to explore as part of their undergraduate education. Now you may be thinking, well, what classes am I gonna be taking this fall? And so for a biological science major, the traditional plan typically involves taking general biology one, general chemistry one, calc one, and expository writing. Students also will take a one credit FIG seminar or a burn seminar as well. This equals 16 credits, and this is a pretty challenging first semester of college, and it might not be right for everyone. And you may be wondering, well, what other options do I have? Can I delay chemistry? Can I delay biology? Um, what if I didn't place into a calculus? Don't worry. We have on our website at biology.ruckers.edu, under the section that's marked about the major, several different four-year plans for students that share with you different ways in which you can take the coursework for the biology major and still graduate on time. So while the traditional plan is common, it is not the only way um, that you have to schedule your courses. And we encourage you to be comfortable with the class plan that you have selected. For those of you who are coming in with AP credit um, in one or more of the courses that you would typically take during uh, that first semester with the traditional plan, um, please note that we do have other classes that are available and designed specifically for freshmen, and you'll learn more about those at the advising uh, days that you attend. In the meantime, take some time this summer to look over the biology website and become familiar with it, um, but otherwise have a happy and healthy, safe summer, and we look forward to seeing you on campus this fall. Take care.